do this instead. Welcome to Uncensored Sales TV. I am your host, Ryan Dowdy, and I am so excited that you are here. Make sure you tap the bell and subscribe so you never miss an episode. I am a sales coach and I help brand new entrepreneurs build six-figure businesses by mastering your sales skills and your mindset. And today I want to talk about this thing that you need to stop doing to grow your business. This is important. Okay. I want you to stop looking for clients and I want you to start building relationships. This mindset shift might be the biggest mindset shift you need to make to have success in your service-based business. I talk to so many brand new entrepreneurs who feel like they're constantly struggling. I can't find clients. I can't find clients. I don't know where to find clients. Where do I hang out? What do I do? Where are these people? Nobody has any money, right? There's all this drama coming up in your life for you. What I really want to encourage you to do is to stop looking for clients and start focusing on building relationships, right? Because every single person that you meet could could potentially be a client, a referral partner, maybe a collaboration partner, a new friend, or it could be a total waste of time. But there's nothing wrong with any of those things. But when we have this energy and we show up in the world like we're looking for something, I need it, I need it, I gotta look for a client, I'm hunting for this very specific thing, that's not good energy and it really doesn't attract or lead to building productive relationships. You might get a couple of clients and make a little bit of money, um, but it's not going to give you the result that you really want, which is a thriving, profitable business. So every single time you show up in the world to represent your business, to have conversations, I want you to focus on building relationships. One, it's going to take the stress off. It's going to make it feel so much easier to connect with new people, right? So many of you are worried about being too salesy or too pushy or too forward. Well, if every relationship that you start is focused on trying to make a sale, it's no wonder that you're feeling salesy right? I want you to go out and build relationships with people. And then if they have the problem that you solve, make an offer to help them because it's no longer salesy because you have a relationship. I often tell the women in uh, my 12 month coaching program that we don't sell to strangers, right? We are not jumping into people's DMs and pitching our services. We are building relationships. And when a person that we have a relationship with, even if it's a new relationship, needs our products or services, then we make an invitation to have a sales conversation and determine if we are in fact the right fit to help that person. And by taking away that expectation and taking away that pressure, you're able to talk to more people, you're able to show up more authentically, and naturally you will be able to find more clients, right? So when you show up every single day, we teach a power hour strategy inside of my community where we spend an hour every single day focused on income producing activities. And the simplest way to put it, income producing activities is talking to people, right? Because relationships equals clients. I'm going to say that for you again. Relationships equal clients. So when you show up for that power hour, instead of saying, well, I'm going to spend an hour today trying to find a client, it's I'm going to spend an hour today building relationships with new people that I can help, or maybe they can help me, right? Because every relationship has an opportunity to provide value to your life in some way. And so again, this is going to help you, A, talk to people in a more relaxed way, but we really take off that pressure and it's going to make you better at asking questions and it's going to make you better at getting to know people. And the better you are at asking questions and getting to know people, naturally, the more people will either want to refer people to you or make introductions for you or have you on a guest in their podcast or have you as a guest expert in their community. But if you show up in the energy of I'm just here to see if you want to buy something from me, you're really going to struggle. And again, you might find some people who buy from you, right? I spent a lot of years cold calling and know what this looks like, but what you really want is a long-term sustainable business, which is going to be built on those relationships because that relationship you build today might not be a client today, right? I'm going to give you some statistics before I wrap this up. At any given time, only three to 5% of your sphere of influence of your circle is actually in the market for your products and services and ready to make a purchase decision right? Only three to 5% of people are ready to make a purchase decision about the service that you offer, which means you've got to have a lot of relationships because those other 95% of people doesn't mean they're never going to buy your services. doesn't mean they're never going to be in the market. doesn't mean they're never going to have the money. It just means that they don't right now. So you need to be focused on building those relationships. So when those people are ready to make a buying decision, they're not going into a Facebook group or asking a friend. They're like, I already have a person who solves this problem. I already have a relationship with this person. So when you really start focused on building relationships, instead of looking for clients, 
that is when your business will take off. If you are interested in hanging out with us on social media and learning more about how to get clients, how to leave your full-time job, how to build a six-figure business, I want you to come follow us over on Instagram at Uncensored Sales. If you hang out on TikTok, follow us at Uncensored Sales there as well. Or we have an amazing Facebook community of awesome women who would love to build relationships with you at the Ambitious Women Entrepreneurs Mastering Sales Skills community. And we'll see you in the next video.